Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. Christmas is in 10 days. It's very cold in the apartment today. I'm not sure what the temperature is outside, but I can definitely feel a little bit of the, uh, the chilly air coming in through the solarium, even though our windows are all closed and all of that. Uh, apartments in Vancouver, one, don't have heat usually, because, or AC, because the temperature when these were built didn't really vary much within about 30 degrees. They're not technically insulated enough to account for this, so it's just, it gets cold sometimes, and then other times it gets really freaking hot. I've been working for the first couple hours of the day. It's almost 12 actually. Yeah. So it's like 11 15 or 1130. And, um, I told you I was going to put together the bookcase today and that is the case. I will be doing that. It's a relatively chill day because I don't have any meetings and I don't have to go into the office, which are my favorite kind of days because it can be a bit of a homebody and get a lot of the data entry stuff done that surrounds my job and make sure that all of that information is up to date with uh, limited distractions. Super important. I'm going to film a brief Invisalign video because I haven't done an Invisalign update in this third tray batch because I haven't thought to do it only because they've been fixing teeth in the back so there really hasn't been any dramatic changes to the front of my smile or anything like that and yeah time just really flies when you're using it it's almost been a year so that's just like that blows my mind that I've, I've had it for almost a year shy like about two and a half weeks so Time does fly and my smile looks really different. It's time to build the Talisha bookshelf. I almost called it a couch again. I almost said Talisha couch. <laughs> or the Talisha. I don't know which one because my name started off as Talisha. to what might be my last physio appointment of the year. Not sure yet, but we'll see. I'm looking forward to it. I actually don't think I've caught a clip of this this year. Um, maybe in passing, but here's the tree. <laughs> That's the real reason we're here. Look at the beautiful Apple store too. There's so many nice things around here. That store is insanely cool inside. Physio was good. It was my last one of the year. I got dry needling done and general adjustments and pressure massage done. How was that? Good. Good. I think I'll go back next year earlier once my benefits reset. And now I'm gonna play around with our new bookshelf a little bit because I have a lot of stuff sitting over there now that I've pulled from other places of our apartment that I think will look good over there. Sorry? You get some of the stuff that's sitting on my uh, table. Yeah, I need to find room for some of that. Hopefully in there too, because there's a lot of stuff, wasted space in there that I just wanna like toss stuff from in that cabinet. So eventually we're gonna need that solarium space back, of course, to be a bed and the poeing is gonna come back out. But right now it's very, um, 
overcrowded with stuff, right? So let's play around with this bookshelf a little bit. I need to find some of the books that we have that we want to put because I don't really want to disturb that shelf too much, you know? This looks good as is. Behind our bed also looks good as is. We have books behind the bed um, as well. Like it's, it's set up like a bookshelf behind our bed, but I stack and uh, have some books as well. So I'm looking for bookends right now and I could have purchased some with this, but I opted out of it. And now I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh my God, they were like probably some of the best, most basic ones that I could have needed that won't take up a ton of space. So I really don't know what I'm gonna do with the bookend situation just yet. I might go to Indigo and start spending some of that $100 gift card because every time I've gone back to Indigo, I keep forgetting the gift card. Now let's do a little bit of bookshelf action. Uh, moving stuff around, getting stuff cleaned up, and then I'm gonna do a little bit of a lift later. And honestly, yeah, I have hockey games on right now too, so that's mostly what I've been doing since I've been back. So there's already a lot happening here. There's a lot of potential. There's a lot of decorative space. Surfaces are everything when we have a small apartment because right now all we ever have to work with is this, barely two sides of that, and honestly this, which is like our coffee table and we need to eat on here sometimes. So we've really been trying to utilize the underside of here, there, but everything gets really crowded very quickly. So it's really important that we have more surfaces. So that is going to save us a bunch. I pulled a lot of stuff off of the underside of here to put into there. And I think I might actually grab the art books too because it's an open display. I don't feel super comfortable storing things there that don't look great. You know what I mean? Like I wanna be able to put things there that fit and like can stack up and down or sit sideways like books. So I'm not trying to make it look, um, like it doesn't have to be the most aesthetic. It does kind of have to be aesthetic. I'm trying to figure all this out from all the stuff that I originally had to move from this table that was back here. That is kind of a key piece of what I did. I pulled the items that either had to move away or that are overcrowding this countertop here and that are sitting under there that I want to have displayed that haven't been able to be displayed because we don't have any surfaces. Let's start figuring some of this out. I'm gonna put some TV on, I'm gonna time lapse this and I'm gonna figure, figure some stuff out here. Okay, so um, we got rid of the old couch because we have this one now. So we got this one because Brian took the old one. So we got a smaller sofa here. The name of this bookshelf, do you see that? I can't see the name, it's very small on that screen. Oh, well, let's see. That's the name. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, you had to have it though. I know, right? So I saw it and I was just like, oh my gosh, I want it. Just because of the name that I looked, I'm like, do we actually, because I was actually looking for bookshelves. Here's a shelf first look. I'll show it again in the morning. I'm having trouble getting the eucalyptus branches to cooperate, but I'll figure that out tomorrow. <laughs> but this is what the top shelf looks like. All temporary for now, but I'm liking the general positioning of things as I figure it out. Here's the middle shelf. And here's the bottom shelf. We have books in other areas too, like I said that we were gonna leave, but down here is where we can start to collect and put them in. I need some bookends as well, so I gotta find those. But as of right now, like I said, those are staying where they are and the ones in our room were likely gonna stay there as well. So yeah, we were able to clear out some of the books and things that were on that. I need to find a place for this now because this shelf item that I used to have sitting underneath the chessboard and stuff now has nowhere to go, but I'll start clearing stuff out and finding spaces for them as we go. And probably over the weekend as well. Like that seems like a really good weekend project for me. So I'm gonna head to the gym shortly, but I just wanted to show the um, updated shelf because honestly, that was a lot of fun to set up initially. And I like how we had so many things that I had to pull from different areas that were overcrowding other shelves and other areas that now look really good and really well placed in this spot. So I'm really happy about that. I also wanna get a book stand for the Huji Home book because um, I found gold stands and things where you can just prop the book up on a little pedestal, not like open, like recipe books, but you can just have it propped 
um, the way it is right now. So I'll just have something under it like sitting there and I think that will be perfect. A solo lift, gym to myself, 20 minutes until it closes. Let's go. That's all you get. I'm about to do that one, but uh, I want to listen to music more than I want to film this. Oh, hi. Is it the end of the vlog? Is it the end of the vlog? Is it, girl? Yeah. Yeah. Listen to me if I'm doing well? <coughs> I can't go that high. Oh. Uh, it's the end of Vlogmas Day 15. Goodbye. I'm crying a little bit. <laughs> mm.